Okay, it is ten to eight in the morning. Ben, what are we doing? Going to get a cat. We are going to get cat! Ah! So exciting. Please leave me alone whilst I eat my food. Thank you. Taking a quick stop because Birch got hungry. He's even cute, Ben. He's very good. Ben, you're good. Nom, 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 nom. Figured out the happiness to our cat. <laughs> the ball thing. Plastic balls. <laughs> you like your fish? He loves to fish. Yeah, you remember to fish. Don't get down. Oh, he hasn't figured out you can get up through there. Ooh. I'm tempted to pull the blinds just so he doesn't... No, we'll be fine. Okay. He's done it once so we now know that that's not a fun thing to do. making it through the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed seeing the journey that my partner and I went on to get our little kitten. 
I would love to introduce you to Birch, like the tree, B-I-R-C-H. He is about three and a half months old now. He is a British short hair and he's a bicolour, so you can see he's got patches of white and also patches of a creamy orange colour, which is actually starting to darken. I can see on the tail, like he's starting to get darker stripes and also up the back. Um, he is a beautiful kitten. Um, we drove all the way down to Cornwall and back, so from where we live it was about four hours each way. So it was quite a long journey. Um, and initially we were thinking of getting a kitten around March time, um, but a lot of things just fell into place and so we wound up getting Birch on the 11th of January. So Birch's birthday is the 12th of October 2019. Um, and one thing that really made me fall in love with British short hairs is just the fact that they're so chill. Um, of course he's a kitten, so he still goes completely manic. But as you can see with him right now, like he's just he's just happy to be here. Um, and the thing with Birch is that he is such a sensitive little soul. Um, he just I feel like animals just kind of get you, but he just knows, and he's such a sweetheart. Like he loves sitting on my lap, um, he loves give, giving me these sort of like nose boots every now and again, which is adorable. Um, he doesn't mind me kissing his head. Um, and yeah, he loves chin rubs and also belly rubs, which is really interesting because a lot of cats don't like that. Um, and yeah, he's a complete purr machine. He just loves and loves to purr, don't you? Yeah, yeah. So he's letting me give him a chin rub at the moment. Yeah, he's a beautiful boy. Uh, like we've only had him for a couple weeks now but I don't know what we would do without him he is such a gorgeous boy and we're very grateful to have him in our lives so yeah if you're wondering why I was like oh yeah I really want to restart my channel and then I went quiet <laughs> it was because on the 11th of January we got this little boy um, but yeah I wouldn't do without him it's been a hectic couple of weeks but it's definitely been worth it, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. He's just a bit snoozy at the moment, aren't you? Yeah. He's had a long day of chasing around <laughs> this fish pole toy, which, um, if you watch Chris and Eve, which is a channel that I love to watch, um, they have two British short hairs, Turbo and Jet, and they love this um, fishing pole fish cat toy. Um, and so the first thing I did when I knew I was getting Birch was I got a cat hammock because they also feature that and I got that same toy and Birch absolutely loves it. So yeah, we'll see you in a video.